All right, Esther, thank you very much. 9.45 on a Thursday morning, and we are continuing uh, Wingarama, Wingapalooza, Wing Ding. We, we don't know what we're calling it, but that's okay. Uh, if you're in the New Haven area, we haven't been down, down to New Haven yet to salute uh, Wing Making for Super Bowl uh, weekend. Barbecue lovers, they go to Bull and Swine. Uh, it's a phenomenal restaurant right there on, uh, on State Street. This morning, they've come to us. We didn't have to go to New Haven. We want you to say hi to uh, General Manager Eileen Bryant and uh, Chef Kevin Wolkett, both of us, uh, both of you here today. Thanks thank for coming in. Thank you. And I know, and I really have to say thank you, especially for the folks that are coming in today and tomorrow because you guys are in overdrive now getting ready for Sunday, aren't you? We are indeed. Um, Sunday we are open for regular lunch service, which mm -hmm. begins at noon. Mm -hmm. We also are available on Uber Eats, so you can have the food delivered to you. Uh -huh. And then we at 4.30, we're starting a ticketed event specifically for the Super Bowl. Right. It is, this big game will be on the big screen. Oh, thank heavens for that. Yes. <laughs> uh, it's $28 a ticket mm -hmm. and it includes barbecue buffet and open bar. Now, I've, been, I've had a pleasure being in both of your restaurants. Bull and Swine and Oak Haven Table and Bar, which is one of my favorites in New Haven. Thank Absolutely, you guys do a, a bang up job. What do you do as a as the executive chef, as a as a head head guy in in the kitchen to get ready to prep for Super Bowl Sunday? It's just a lot of preparation, like you said. You know, just making sure that orders are coming in, mm -hmm. that making sure that everybody's kind of doing their part mm -hmm. to kind of help facilitate us getting a great product out right. in a timely fashion. You have a big catering business, right? Yes. yes. Yeah. Okay, now let's first talk about the wings and then we'll migrate over. We'll start here because obviously everyone's doing wings. That's what we're, we have you here for. Uh, you've got uh, one of your three flavors here. What do you got so here? So we do our wings a little different. We dry rub everything mm -hmm. in, in house and then we smoke it. So these wings are smoked for two and a half hours. Okay. Then they, you know, they get chilled and you can have them served with any one of our many sauces that are on the table. Okay. Um, like one we have, we brought over here today. Okay. And we have the two others. Okay. Um, and everyone served with blue cheese or a sweet... Asian dipping sauce. Yes. Yeah. I like the sound of that. Okay. But now <laughs> here's where things get a little challenging for these nice folks. Because you just saw, you just saw the top view. You've got ribs. Yeah. Great. But, but look at this bad boy. Take, take this shot. <laughs> okay. That is, I'd say that's a good... It's eight pounds. Yeah, I was going to say seven pound brisket, so I, I underplayed it for a minute. Now, it's easy, I, I don't want to say easy, I don't know what you guys do back there, but it's easy to take orders uh, for the catering for wings, 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 wings. How do you prep for brisket if you're doing that on Sunday? Oh, uh, we do big, large trays, mm -hmm. and we don't, we just slice everything nice and nice. Uh -huh. Everything's get just a little bit of sauce on it just to keep it nice and moist when it goes out the building. Right, you yeah. get to work. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah, you're here to here here to work. By the way, so <laughs> slice that I once because I want to taste that. While we're doing that, t take us through what else you have here in terms of what's on the, the menu at Bull and Swine. Yeah, so we have a couple fixins that we brought with us. There's the sweet potato mash coleslaw, mm -hmm. macaroni salad, mm -hmm. and our collard greens, which mm -hmm. are very popular. Right. All of our meats that are smoked in-house come mm -hmm. with pickled red onions and pickles, which mm -hmm. we also make in mm -hmm. the restaurant. Mm -hmm. you, I, see, I see what you're doing. You're the general manager, but you're making making sure he's doing all right on lunch. <laughs> Better him than me. They don't let me near sharp yeah, objects exactly. like that. So, <laughs> so, so what, you, got a, you got a good edge on, on that brisket, yeah. so the things can't... How long did you cook that? Uh, this goes for 12 hours. Okay. Yeah. And you'll have... If I want to call you up and say, hey, you know what? I'm going to do brisket for my Super Bowl yep. party, you, you'll be able to take mm -hmm. care of me. Yes, we e will. Excellent. And all the, all the fixings are there all as well. Yeah. Uh, again, 28 bucks gets you in the door on Sunday for the big party? For a barbecue buffet and open bar. Oh, my God. That sounds good. <laughs> and, and it's a 13-inch color TV that you'll be it's watching it on? Or is it black and white? projector. Okay. <laughs> good. good. Excellent. All right, Kevin, uh, I, thanks for coming in. Thank and, you. And uh, I hope you work hard on Sunday, but yeah. not too hard that so you can enjoy some of the We're games We're going to enjoy some, okay. some, some oh, beers. Yeah. Listen, I'm going to grab this right here as I toss to Rachel, who's got to look at, at the four, so. <laughs> oh, even without the sauce, that yeah. is good. That's good brisket. Rachel, take it away. 